Hello ladies and gentlemen, MDef here, I think it's about time we finally found a new game to record. And what better game than Farming Simulator 2013, woo! Anyway, yeah, so let's go ahead and start a new game on normal here. Now I've played this game a little bit before as you saw there in save game one. It says eight hours, but really I just paused it and did some other shit or whatever. Also I've skimmed through a few guides about it, so I know a little bit of what to do. So this is welcome to your farm. That house is purely cosmetic. You have to do absolutely nothing with it. Unless maybe there's a mod that lets you sleep or whatever. I don't know. Anyway. This is all of our tractors here. They all suck except for this green one over here. It's the fastest of them all. It's speed more than makes up for it. It's 30% weakness to poison damage. So that's a plus. Alright. So first thing you're going to need to do is get that tractor. Attach the trailer to it with the Q button by backing up into it. And then just park it over here. You'll see why later. Attach that. Lower that. Turn it on. Let's get to harvesting. Very straightforward. You just uh, press the W key to go forward. If you go too fast, it'll it'll tell you you're going too fast. You need to slow down to cruise control level two. But if you hold down W and just keep hitting two whenever you get up to ten miles per hour, that should it should be fast enough and you know slow, but slow enough not to detach the uh, the harvester there. Oh, let's see. So I'm going too fast. This game's very realistic. I know because I'm actually a farmer myself. Whenever I farm, I like to you know I always press tab to switch between vehicles instantly like that. The good thing about this game is it doesn't require reflexes, so I don't need really a uh, really high frame rate to, re to uh, record and play at the same time. Alright, so our tractor is full now, so what we gotta do in order to keep harvesting, as it says in the corner there, we have to go to our little trailer here. That's where we can store all of our food that we just harvested here. Press O to extend the tractor's long nose like that and sneeze all that shit out. You don't have to press any buttons, you just gotta sit there and wait. Jerk off a bit. I don't know, just pick your nose. That's the longest sneeze I've ever seen in my life. Alright. Alright, now we can take off. Actually, we... Oh, oh well. I'll come back to it later. Who cares? Alright, well that's it for harvesting. We've got a trailer full of, of wheat there. I didn't get all the wheat, but who cares, you know. Time is just as valuable as wheat in this... In any other crop in this game, just as like in real life, so... Now what we need to do is go get our cultivator so we can replow all of these fields so we can replant some more and get even more money. That's so. Yeah. Ram this trailer out of the way. This tractor, I'm sorry. Excuse me, excuse me, pardon me. Well this video is not going as well as I hope. I see we have, we have an orgy of fucking tractors here. Can't get any of them unstuck? Ah, why did I do this to myself? I just wanted to use a different tractor. Alright. Desperate times call for desperate measures. You're gonna use the combine harvester. Tear them to shreds if you have to. Uh, well that seems to have almost done the trick. Alright, so where are we? Oh yeah, cultivating. Alright, so after we've left quite a mess here, now we just need to take the best tractor here. The yellow and green one here. I don't know what company it is, who cares? And attach this little blue thing. This is the cultivator. This will reset your fields to where you can plant more seeds. Good thing cultivating the fields here will both get rid of this straw that you left behind here. And also the wheat that you didn't even harvest. So, if you miss any, that is. Like like I did. Now that looks a lot better now, doesn't it? Alright. We're done with the cultivator for now. Now what we need is a sower. That is what's going to plant our seeds. See, detach this. Leave that there. Park it like it's hot. Let's go over here. Let's see, which one's the sower? Uh, it would be this one over here. Excuse me, pardon me. Go ahead and get attached to this one. 
Alright, now, now we need some seeds first, so let's go on over here to get some seeds. Now you might think, oh well, wheat was the first thing we are introduced to, that might be a good thing to plant. No, actually, canola. See, if you look here at the prices, it's almost double everything else, so it's almost double that of wheat. So let's go ahead and refill on some canola. Refill, refill, refill. It won't let me refill. There we go. Now we're filling. Jacking me around like that. So, canola's good for money. Alright, now we're running back to the fields yet again. This time we're seeding the fields with some canola seeds. As you can tell by the little discoloration there. Give it a little color. And can't be any more obvious why this game's so addicting. I mean, look at this flawless fun factor. Replayability. Woo! The farmer contemplates his life choices as he rides up and down the fields with grace. He's thinking about his profits, his wife and kids, about how he's almost out of seed. Oh, we got enough for the field seeded. Guess I'll go ahead and move on to the next thing here. After I get this last seeds in. Good, good. Any moment now, any moment now. Maybe I'll finish off this row. No? Guess not. Alright. Let's go home. That'll be good for now. Alright. <laughs> Let's leave that rolling. Now the next thing we're going to want to do is sell everything that we just picked up. That we just harvested out of the ground. But before we do that, let's go get ourselves another trailer. So we can hold all the stuff better. So to do that, we go north. To, because that's where the farm store is. Look both ways before crossing the street. Okay, it's all clear. Good, good. Just casually stroll over to the store over here. Hello, good sir. Nice suit. Alright, now that we have bought our second trailer, we can go ahead and attach it. No, no thank you. I don't want to read your stupid hints. And take it back to the farm. Save some time for it by just going up this incline here. This is how you farm. This is modern day farming right here. Scaling mountains to get to your house quicker. Woohoo! No big deal. You can actually attach two trailers together, as I will now show here. What you want to do is line it up very carefully. And uh Okay. Okay, that's okay. That's alright. We'll just back it up and try again. Okay, steer into it. Alright, it is hooked. That is a lot harder than it looks, actually. Now we got these two play wagons over here. I'll show you, see these silos in the background? If you're playing on anything other than the hard, you actually have a lot of seeds stored up. I mean, not a lot of seed, but a lot of grain stored up. So first thing you might want to do, since you have no animals to feed or anything, you have nothing else to do with it, go ahead and pick some of these up and go ahead and go sell them. You go ahead and top this first wagon off with some canola. And then if I can get started up here, we'll fill the second one the rest of the way. Oh, after I crash into the pole. Alright, and now we're off to the mill. The mill is where you can sell all of your all of your harvest. Go ahead and climb over the mountain here. Should be no problem. This tractor is good enough for it. Oh yeah, no problem whatsoever. Oh, oh, come on, you can make it. 
Alright, here we are at the mill. All we gotta do is fit into this tiny ass thing here and dump our load into the grates. And now we go back home. After we chase our own tail. Whee! Alright, it's a pretty monotonous job, but all you gotta do now is just repeat the process. Uh, that should empty, completely empty that silo out. Now we just gotta empty out the other ones. You can all, you can sell them all to the same place too if you like. I wonder if I can put anything else in the first trailer. Probably not. And we unload at the mill again. Unload. Very much replay value in this game. See, or you can also crash into a tree if you like. All right, I started a new game because I actually managed to get that tractor and those two trailers stuck in the tree. Uh, well, I guess it's just my lucky fucking day. Well, anyway, apart from the silos, you can also get potatoes and sugar beets back here. They're a pain in the ass to plant, though. All right, let's load up on some of those. All those sugar beets. Sugar beets. And hopefully, okay. I guess some more of those. Fair enough. I'll just sell some sugar beets for now. If it'll let me position it right. All right. This is already getting monotonous once again. But whatever. Got to do what we got to do to make some cash, right? Sugar beet is not accepted here. What? Oh. Well, this is the mill, I guess. What would they do with sugar beets? Alright, so, uh, fuck. Where, where else do we go? Let's see. Look at the mini map here. See, what are those green things in the lower right corner? Are those places where I can drop off stuff? Probably. Let's go. So let's go that way then. God damn, that was a letdown. Alright, let's see if. This icon will buy my stuff. Whoop! Whoop! Okay, where is the drop-off point? Uh, is there another grate somewhere that I can... Sugar beet's not accepted here. What the f... Will nobody buy my stuff? Will they? Yeah, let's see. Well, this doesn't tell me shit. Alright. Uh, let's see. Will cows eat sugar beets? I don't know. Let's go find out. Let's go visit the cows. Let's pay our milk makers a visit. Alright, cows. Now, I know you can't resist some delicious potatoes and sugar beets. There are any cows out here? No, what the hell? How about the sheep? No, probably not the sheep. Alright, I guess we're headed north. See if anyone up there will want some. There has to be someone out there who will help me eat all of these beets. I mean, I went through the trouble of picking them, didn't I? Didn't I? Well, not really. Good evening, madam. Do you have a moment to talk about our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ? And would you like to buy some sugar beets today? I must deliver these sugar beets to the world or they will all starve. Excuse me. Pardon me. Pardon me. Sorry. All right, let's go over this hill here as usual. This has become an everyday ritual for us hardcore farmers. Oh great, there's a fence there. How am I going to get around that? See, a mountain is no problem, but a fence? Oh god. No, Dr. Girlfriend, I already told you, you cannot afford 11 tons of sugar beets or potatoes. This is the most secure gas station I've ever seen in my entire life. Alright, surely this train station will want my sugar beets because obviously they can do more with it than a mill can. 
It's, it's a train station. There's some garbage back there. Put some of that in my beats. Put that some of that in a trailer. Give that to them too. They deserve it. Where where is it up here? I have to drive all the way the fuck up here. No. Oh, I put it in the trains. Okay. Of course. That's how that works. Here, have some potatoes. Bzz, bzz. Sorry, I cannot respond to your text right now. I am farming. Alright. We finally have someone who... Not potatoes, they're sugar beets. We finally someone have someone that bought our sugar beets. It's about damn time. Oh, mission accomplished. As the old man sat there refueling his Mach 3 speed tractor, he contemplated his victory over the sugar beets at long last. He had a long, angry, monotony-filled day of painstakingly mowing, harvesting, cultivating, sowing, and hauling ahead. He can only hope that between repaying his bank loan and the foreign invaders crippling his economy, that his crops would not resist being sold again. Alright, now back to the walkthrough. I, uh, uh... Oh, fuck this. 